morning, Lucky Nation, and welcome to another beautiful day. All right, guys, today I am leaving Victoria this morning. It is currently 8.30 a.m. Today is my last day with Jennifer for the next 25 days, not forever. <laughs> <laughs> so right now we're gonna, I'm going to grab my bike, we're going to leave the apartment, we're going to walk all the way to the ferry because my boat leaves in an hour and a half. We're going to go for a little coffee, but I will see you guys once we get onto the boat. Alrighty guys, we are currently at the ferry. The bike is all loaded. We're gonna say our goodbyes to Jen. Oh. Uh, and yeah, we'll just check in with you guys once uh, I get on the boat. Several of them. Alright guys, we made it. We are on the boat heading to Port Angeles. I love this boat. It's pretty cool. The fact that you can just stand outside in the front. That. Uh, I won't lie. I already miss you, Jen. I love you, baby. Alright guys, let's get this journey started. I'm just going to head inside, start editing yesterday's vlog. And I'll see you guys once we get to Port Angeles. We made it to Port Angeles and right now I'm just getting changed. I'm setting up the bike. It is a beautiful sunny day here and I'm gonna be heading down this direction. But before, I wanna go grocery shopping, maybe buy a bag of dehydrated nuts, fill up my water bottles, and then we're gonna hit the road because I believe I have 50 to 60 kilometers to ride today and it is already 12.30 so I don't wanna arrive there too late and set up when it's dark. So let's just hit the grocery stores and let's hit the road. Alright guys, so I stopped at Safeway to get a little breakfast and to buy some dehydrated nuts and some bars. I got myself some strawberry and blueberries just for some fast energy. And I'm still waiting for this footage to export 43 minutes. So it's going to be a hassle to vlog every day, especially if I'm camping. We'll have to find a way to make it work. Um, yeah, it, te it tells me it takes me 4 hours and 30 minutes to get to the campground and it's currently 1 p.m. so I don't have much time to wait so I think I'm gonna finish that off once I get to the campground and just trying to make it work but besides that guys enjoy the upcoming clips the beautiful view I don't even know what it's gonna look like but I'm super excited so I'll see you in a bit all right team sorry for the crappy audio I didn't feel like putting the mic on but I'm pulling out the solar panel that will be connected to my GPS besides that I've been riding for about I don't know, like two hours now, I have some 30 miles to do. Yeah, so basically, I'm going up here. So basically, like, we're halfway. Not too bad. All right, I'll check in with you guys whenever I decide to stop next. Alright guys, I'm super excited. I've encountered my first problem, so let's solve this together. Basically what happened is that... Actually, let me take this off. Um, this screw fell off. So this is shaking and it's rubbing my tire. It's making a super annoying sound and also it could burst my tire from always like cutting at one spot. So I think I have extra screws for this. So I'm just gonna try to, to fix it. The other, the other side is fine. Ah. Sweet guys, so I have a couple more extra screws. 
I have my, oh, I'm gonna drop my strawberries. No. Yeah, okay. Mm. All right. Bam. It looks brand new. So the problem is this a little bit further down there is all rocks. It's super massive rocks. I'm scared to like bust my tires or bent my just anything on the bike. So I think from like all the bumps, it's just been freaking. I think it broke the screw basically. Anyways, I'm gonna put everything away now. I'm gonna keep on biking. I'm about an hour and a half from my camping site, so can't wait to go there, take a shower, eat some food. So I'm starving. I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, guys, I think I found a spot to sleep at. There's a co um, the camping ground is closed, so it should be super quiet. I think I'm gonna throw my tent in this area where the surface is a little bit flatter. We have the river right here. Oh, looks amazing. Maybe take a little take a little shower, cook some food down here. Sunset, sun's coming down. So, time to wash my clothes and get clean. Woo! Man, what a day, guys. I'm exhausted. I'm pissed. My legs are tired. As you saw from the last clip, I was going to stay at that camping ground, but I promised my parents and my girlfriend that I would call them just to know, let them know that I'm safe and I had no connection. Plus the campsite was closed, so I kind of felt bad about that. I saw that there was something on the map. I don't know, it's like a coffee shop, like right over there. I, c I didn't have internet, so I didn't know how far it was. I was like, man, I, I, just, I gotta take a shot at it and bike all the way there. It actually ended up being an extra 10 miles. So I did an extra 10 miles at what I was supposed to do today, so I'm just, I'm just exhausted. I'm just super happy to have a campground and they have hot showers and they have coffee and food. <gasps> oh. <sighs> what a special day. To be honest, I was thinking about this while I was cycling and all the bad shit that happened. I fell, I scraped my bike, I scraped my bag. I just, bunch of, I went. The GPS brought me on a road that was basically just all rocks. I basically had to push the bike uphill because I couldn't bike it because it was also super steep right beside it. Was, it was just stupid. But it made me think of when people are diagnosed with cancer, it just hits you and you have to deal with it and you can't quit because as soon as you quit, you die. And just being in that situation today and thinking about Derek, Patricia and everybody, and they can't quit they have to keep pushing and as much as it sucks and you're tired and just shit's going bad you have to keep pushing or else it's just the end <sighs> that was that was a deep metaphor for today <sighs> all right i'm gonna set up the tent and everything i'll show you guys what it looks like after so this is the whole setup got the tent here i'm gonna make a little I think I'm gonna cook something after I buy something in there. And bike, the sun is setting. <sighs> I'm exhausted. <clears throat> All right guys, it is currently 8 p.m. right now. Um, I'm exhausted, my tummy is full. I decided to buy some food in there and instead of cooking outside, but honestly, I'm just gonna go to bed right now. I wanna say thank you for tuning in to this vlog. I wanna say a big thank you for being a part of the journey and for having donated for helping this cause so i'm so tired i have a hard time speaking but guys without you i can't make a difference i can only start i can only i can only spark the change but you guys have to be there to push with me and help me out and i really appreciate everybody that stepped up and has shown their support if you guys want to make a bigger difference go to gofundme page donate listen to the stories share the stories Share it with newspaper, share it with the radio, whatever you think might help. Everything, every help is sincerely appreciated. Guys, thank you very much and have an amazing night and I'll see you tomorrow. Peace.